Hello fellow traders, welcome to another video on my channel Tradition Algo where I discuss about trading strategies, indicators, algo trading and trading tools. In this video, I am going to show you how you can install multiple MT4 instances in the same PC. The process is same for MT5 as well. I will show the little difference in the process at the end of this video. This may be necessary when you want to trade in different MT4 accounts simultaneously from the same computer. This is also a common requirement for the algo traders who wants to run different expert advisors in different MT4 terminals. There could be another scenario where you want to copy the trades from one MT4 terminal to another MT4 terminal. So without making further delay, let me show you how you can configure multiple MT4 instances in your desktop. So here is the step one. You have to go to your broker's website and download the MT4 terminal setup. My broker is OctaFX, so I will simply go to Google and will type MT4 setup download OctaFX. So let me click on this link scroll down a little bit so as i am using windows so i will download the setup for windows if you are using mac you can download the setup for the same now let's go to step two we have to install the setup file with default configuration so let me click on the setup file and you can click on next and it will install this terminal with the default configuration now, as I have installed it before, I'm not going to do this step. So after the installation is finished, we will go to C drive and then we will open program files x86 folder. Here we can find our installation directory. So it should be named with our broker. Like I have installed OctaFX MP4 setup. So my installation folder would be OctaFX market MetaTrader 4. I will simply click on this folder and will click on copy. Now I will click on program files x86 folder on the address bar and then I will click anywhere on this white area and then paste the file I have just copied. So it created a copied folder of our installation directory. Now here is the step four. We can rename this folder to any name we want, but for the simplicity, let me put it hyphen two. Time for step five. We will go to this folder and copy the terminal.exe file, and then we will go to desktop and we'll paste it as a shortcut. So let's rename this shortcut to MT4-2. Now here is our final step to verify the setups. It's time to check if it open a separate terminal when there is already a MT4 terminal open. So for that, let us open our main terminal, which I have installed previously. Now let me open our second MT4 terminal which is MT4-2. So as you can see, there are two MT4 icons in the taskbar. The first one is our previously MT4 terminal and the second one is our newly MT4 terminal. We are done here. If I close both the terminals now and reopen them once again, You can see in the terminal header, there are different terminal accounts. Now the entire process is same for MT5 as well. The only difference is in step three. So let me recap the step three. We will go to C drive and we'll open the x86 for MT4 terminal. But in case of MT5, we have to open the program files instead of program files x86. And inside this, we can find our MT5 installation directory. The rest of the process is same for the MT5 as well. 
I hope you find the information helpful and insightful in your trading journey. Like I always say, trading is a continuous learning process and there is always something new to discover. Always remember to approach trading with discipline, patience and sound risk management strategy. Keep learning, keep growing. Lastly, remember to subscribe my channel for more trading content and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos. Also, feel free to comment with any questions or suggestions for the future topics you would like us to cover. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video.